Hello and welcome back. It is great to see you here. So we are here in Prodigy English today and we are also getting pretty close to the end of 2022. So the year is almost over. We're heading into December, getting pretty close there. So I wanted to go ahead and kick off uh, sort of my end of the year videos with the five changes I would like to see to Prodigy English for next year. The five things I want to see added or changed for next year. Before I begin though, make sure to like, be sure to subscribe. It takes only a couple of seconds. It's super helpful for me. You'll also know when videos come out. All right, so let's go ahead and get into it. Now we have our pet here, right? We have our dog Luna. I'm gonna go ahead and give Luna a little pat. Now, we know that cats are going to be coming to the game sometime soon. And since Luna has been added, I've had such a great time with her uh, that I want to go ahead and see cats added. So as we click over here, it says Pet Store. And so when I click into Pet Store, we have the dogs. Let's go ahead and get some cats under here. And then let's go ahead and get some hamsters and some birds and other things like that. And when we do this, Please, please, please don't make it only dogs or only cats or only hamsters or only guinea pigs or only zebras. Whatever the pets that are there, let's go ahead and have one of each. That would be so awesome to have a dog and also a cat and then have a place where the cat can go ahead and do different things other than follow you around. Uh, that would add a lot, of more, a lot more depth to the game and it would also increase the amount that we want to play it and the amount of English questions we want to answer. So number one, cats. Let's add some cats and start building up the pets here. Uh, number two is seasons. I would love to see some beautiful trees here. Now the pine trees don't really change that much. That's why they're called evergreens, right? But let's go ahead and see and it's like pine trees everywhere. My goodness. Here we go. Wouldn't it be lovely to have a couple different colors in here? Some reds, some yellows, some oranges and have it change, you know, right before Halloween. That would be amazing to add that. And then we're coming up to winter, so maybe we could go ahead and have them fall off and then get some snow on top of our pine trees and then also on top of these, our oak trees with just the limbs bare. I would love, love, love to see that. And then maybe the grass turns a little bit browner towards uh, uh, October into the autumn season. And then, you know, there's snow on the ground. How cool would that be? If we had seasons, then we would be able to have winter coats, we'd be able to get the hats. We know, we know hats are coming, but they're not in the game yet. And how do we know hats are coming? Well, if we go here into our outfits, there's a place for them, right? There's a place for hats, so let's get some hats. Let's get some galoshes. Let's get some winter boots, right? Maybe top of a snowsuit, bottom of a snowsuit. Uh, like a, a snow visor or something like that that you might wear if you're uh, snowmobiling. So let's get the seasons in. We had a really nice summer edition with all of the different beach items and beach gear and all of that, but it would be so cool if some of the items that we're able to purchase in the stores are seasonal and it would get us excited to be and play in the game every single season. So every four months we'd get a little reward for that, right? Now, I think the fishing is really cool. But fishing storage is a problem. And it's a problem because number one, fish aren't stackable. They don't stack on top of each other. Uh, I haven't, you know, let me go ahead and pick up a couple just so we can double check. Where are my fish? I, I might have sold all of my fish. So I'll, I'll go ahead and double check. If you know if fish are stackable now, I haven't really uh, checked them out in a long, long time. Um, go ahead and leave that comment in the comment section. And if you have other things you would like to get added, please go ahead and add that in the, in the comment section as well. Um, also a wardrobe. All of the clothes are so cool, but if we come into our house and we only have 200 storage for all of the resources that we wanna collect in order to have like building projects and stuff, all of the clothes, and then i don't know if i have any fish in here at all uh let's see let's see and then fish yeah fish are not stackable yet so um uh, all of the fish storing everything in here there just isn't enough room for it all so let's have a wardrobe storage where you can go and then you can change your clothes and then if there's an item that like the pink tie-dye shirt if we actually see the pink tie-dye here then that would be so easier to grab i wouldn't have to click it 
add it to the backpack. Let's see what it looks like, I don't remember. And then go ahead and put it on here. I could see what it looks like instead of going to here to take a look and see what that's going to look like on me. So having those little changes, huge, huge quality of life changes in the game for all of us players. Now, the last thing on my list, and I really want to hear what you guys would like to see, is an interior of the home. So when we come into the home, instead of it just being like a pantry where we store our stuff in, let's start to get the furniture. Let's start to get the home. How do we know that homes are coming, right? How do we know that there's going to be floors? Well, if we click on here, we have flooring up here. So we, we have fences. There are decorations, there's furniture. So I would love to see us uh, starting to get some recipe for fences, starting to get some recipe for flooring, and then have an interior where we're able to go ahead and build and expand inside. So this little room is an internal place for furniture, kind of how it is in Prodigy Math. Um, I would absolutely love that. Um, so yeah, super excited to go ahead and see these changes. I hope that they're coming. Uh, devs, please, please give it, give these things to us. Expand the game in this way. Um, really excited for it. So, uh, love to see cats. Love to see seasons. I'd love to see a winter season coming up. You know, maybe there's uh, different objectives where you can go ahead and build snowmen. Um, aquarium storage would make storing so much easier and I would fish probably every day. I would probably fish every day if the fish didn't take up so much space. Um, wardrobe, having my clothes away from the sticks just makes sense and make it a little wardrobe where we walk in the house and we're able to change it if we would like to. And then also the interior of the home. Do you want your in the inside of your house to look like a medieval castle? It's there. Do you want it to look like a cabin? Do you want it to look like the Barbie dream house? You know, have those options for us so we're able to go ahead and get that and take uh, get that take it take care of it, play around with it and enjoy it. Let's go ahead and just get our gems quickly here at the end. Let me know what you think. Um, make sure you are subscribed. Make sure you are liking and uh, in the comments, let me know what changes you would like to see. All right. Um, have a great Thanksgiving. Keep on prodiging on. And I'll be looking forward to seeing you back here next time. Take care all. Bye-bye.